Hi Okies, we are back and we're doing something a little bit different this time. We don't have a box to open for you, which is a little bit sad. I already did that. Yeah. <laughs> so today we are going to do a Halloween Haunts pin tag. So thank you to the Siskateers yeah. um, for tagging us yeah. in this Halloween Haunts pin tag. We've never done this, so yeah. that'll be fun. It's a whole new experience. Yes. Yeah. Um, we will link their channel down below if you want to go mm -hmm. follow them. And yeah. We also have a box exchange coming up with do. the Siskateers. So, so that's be on the lookout too. for that. Yeah, well. sisters swapping boxes with sisters. So that's exciting. Woohoo! Yeah. Okay, so the first question right. is trick or treat. Show a pin that you think is a trick or a treat. Trick or a treat. Trick you want to go treat. first? Yep, I chose treat. So I don't know how to do this. But here's mine. I chose treat. I chose a donut because I thought that was cute and fun. And I love that it has a bite taken out of and it. And who doesn't love donuts? I mean, right? And donut. <laughs> it matches. It coordinates. That's I should have. <laughs> I chose a trick and a treat because mine is Maleficent, but it is a Maleficent caramel apple. So this was one of my favorite pins from our last trip. And this was an interesting pin tag because we are new to pin collecting yes. in itself. So we didn't have a, <laughs> a whole lot to choose from here, but I think we worked it out. The question for this one is, um, which villain would you like to trick or treat with? And I chose Hades because I just think he is so funny and sassy and he's just hilarious. I think he's so great. Okay. I'm going to change this up a little bit. <laughs> Because I can't think of which villain I would want to trick or treat with. I mean, I kind of think they'd all be fun. I'm going to say Jack Skellington. Now, I know he's not a villain, but Christmas Town thinks he's a villain. And I think it would be fun to go trick or treating with Jack Skellington. He'd be so excited. Next okay. One. Question two is Masquerade. Which character would you like to dress up as for Halloween? Show a pin. Okay. Mine's kind of funny. And you guys know who I love. So I had to choose the Toy Story aliens. I think they would be so fun to dress up as. That I think I'd be a pretty cute Toy you Story alien. would be a super cute Toy Story alien. That's precious, and that is a super cute I do pin. love that pin. That's one of my favorite pins that I have. Um, this one was tricky, so I chose one of kind of just like my all-time favorites here. <laughs> Who doesn't want to dress up as Meriwether? <laughs> <laughs> I think I could be a super cute... Merryweather and the cutest Merryweather <laughs> make everything blue. That would be so fun. She's she's precious. She is. Okay, so the next one is just a question. Okay, what is your favorite villain song? Mine is Poor Unfortunate Souls. It's good. It's classic. I know. I like Mine always one. surprises me. Um, <laughs> I like Be Prepared, <laughs> and they changed it in the new movie, and it mm -hmm. wasn't it wasn't as impactful. I didn't think, but I love Be Prepared. That's you can't. Which Hear is so funny, because Lion King is one of my very favorite movies, but I don't like Scar at all. I think he is mm -hmm. the meanest villain out of all of yeah. them. Yeah, he's vicious. Number four is good witch or bad witch. Show a pin of your favorite princess or villain. So I said earlier that I have two favorite villains, and my other favorite is always Cruella de Vil. It's Halloween time, so we had to go with, had to go with villains here. I That's love Cruella. One. I think she's so fun. She actually has a really good song, too. I sing her yeah. song a lot. I'm not <laughs> not a Cruella fan. I think she's I'm just great. not. So I'm excited to show this pin. Um, so I went with villain as well. My favorite villain is Maleficent. This pin was hard-earned on our last Disney trip because my daughter actually got this one from a cast member, and I wanted it so <laughs> bad. And I had to work and work and work to finally trade her. And I don't remember what I ended up. A, a Pascal she's down on the floor she's telling me I traded her a Pascal I don't remember but I had to work and beg and put in lots of effort time she to get that Maleficent pin have it for so she long. yeah okay um okay the next one is what villain power would you like to have and this one's kind of hard for me this is really hard <laughs> I don't remember who I said we thought oh, oh, we prepared oh. for these we we tried to be prepared we thought about them a little bit some of them are kind of tricky this is tricky. um I think I would have to go with Jafar. Okay. Because I'm kind of a control freak. 
<laughs> and it would be, be nice is to just like control freak. you know have a little staff and be like I don't really want you to do that <laughs> you're gonna do what I want yeah as a teacher I could definitely yeah I could definitely use yeah. that y'all I don't know I struggled on this one I Maleficent's my favorite villain and I love the steampunk dragon in the parade in <laughs> Disney World so I'm just thinking it would be kind of cool to turn into a dragon. That like that, I don't know what I would use that for to scare my children when they don't want to go to bed. That's what I would use that for. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. <laughs> okay, the next one is haunting. Show okay. your scariest pin. And like I said, like Kristen said earlier, we are kind of new to mm -hmm. pin trading. I have um, not been trading. <laughs> She's just been buying. I've been buying. <laughs> So there's that, but I don't really have any scary pins. So I just really like this pin and I think he's funny and he's kind of scary because he has fire on his head. So, well, anybody that just bursts into flames and yells at you <laughs> will be scary. <laughs> so he's not scary, but I love Anger. So Anger is my favorite of the Inside Out characters. This would be me before I turned into the Maleficent Dragon. <laughs> my children wouldn't go to bed. Um, okay, so... Again, we're yeah, we're new to this, and I have not been purchasing any pins be because children and teacher. Um, so I'm just going off of what we have from when we were trading in the parks, and this was one of the random ones I got. But she, she's Looks terrifying, y'all. Really like she is really scary, and I wouldn't want to run into her in a dark alley. She looks scary on she that pin. It's just terrifying and she's just scary. an unhappy person she's got this mean side smirk showing all of her teeth yeah. and her nose is all pinched she's yeah she's she's scary anybody that's a fan of chopping off heads is not my friend so so speaking of which okay which villain would you not want to meet on halloween and when we prepared i said queen of hearts because i don't want her to chop my head off and she's like and she looks so scary She's on this pen. Super scary. Yeah. She, the pen scared you already. It did. <laughs> it was also, a scary pen. Scar. He's just mean. And he's a lion. I mean, he's gonna knock you off the cliff. Yeah. I don't That's know why, why you're trick or like treating him. on a cliff, but if you were, I might be. He'd knock you off. You never know. Um, we were discussing this, and I couldn't, I couldn't decide yet again because these questions are really hard for me. Um, and Ryan said Oogie Boogie, and I thought that's kind of perfect. Mm -hmm. Like that would be. He would be scary to run into he'd, while you're trick. He'd he's be scary, scary to run into. I'm sorry, bugs, bugs coming at you. I don't want to be by you. So I really do like the oogie boogie hat though for oogie boogie bash. Yeah. Have you seen it? I don't know. It just like is I, a little. It looks like a little stocking cap, but it's oh. oogie boogie's head, and then like on his little point, he has a little spider hanging down, like a Santa hat almost. I want to do anything oogie boogie bash. Yeah, we, we need to go. We I really wanna. do. Okay. Go. Um. Number eight, crystal ball. Show your favorite mystery pin. And so I chose this one, and of course it doesn't have anything. None of mine have anything to do with Halloween. But this was one of my very first trades when we went, were in Disney last year. And I was so excited. Those had just come out when yeah. we were there. And Moana is my favorite. And I ended up finding all but one of those in the park. It's just a cool. And it's just cool looking. Collection. Yeah. Yeah. So that's the one I chose. Um, for whatever reason, <laughs> I was bound and determined when we were in Disney World last time to find a pineapple pin. I love pineapples. You love Dole Whips. I love Dole Whips. It's my favorite Disney treat for sure. And I just wanted a pineapple pin. And this one looks like a pineapple Mickey head. And it's just precious. So this again was just a, a trader that a staff member had that we popped off. So, so fun. I do like that pin. Cute. I like it too. Simple. Okay, number nine. Who is your favorite villain sidekick? Did we have a question with that? The last one? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No. Okay. I thought I was messing up. All right. Villain who sidekick. is your favorite villain sidekick? And I said somebody, and now I don't remember who I said. The hyenas. The hyenas. Yes. See, thank we prepared. You. We talked about this. Thank you. I do like the hyenas. Mm -hmm. I just think they're funny. And I was. I loved the Lion King live action. I really truly did. But I think, I think they watered down a few things, and I was a little disappointed yeah. that the hyenas were watered down. Yeah. I didn't think they were as funny. It looked like National Geographic to me. <laughs> <laughs> I felt like I was watching National Geographic in the movie theater, and I paid a lot of money to get in there. It was good. I, I mean, I enjoyed it. I'm not going to, like, rag on it or anything, but it wasn't my favorite of the live action. Yeah. Um, okay. Uh, this is a question, not a pin. Yep. Flotsam and Jetsam, I think, are my favorite. 
uh, just because I think they're the ones I remember the most from when I was a kid. Mm -hmm. I, and it goes in my ears. Um, and one of our favorite bands, Blue October, has a song, Into the Ocean, yep. where it mentions Flotsam and Jetsam. And I remember when I was younger and looked up Flotsam and Jetsam was. to see what those words meant. And I was like, oh, it makes so much sense. Yes. And, and they've so kind clever. of been my favorites ever since. Really and I feel clever. like Disney's nobody, clever. like, if you don't get the joke, you just don't get it. You just don't get it. You just don't get it. And then it's not funny. <laughs> Wow. <laughs> okay. We're almost, um, we're almost through this, y'all. We're almost there. We're tired. <laughs> it's late. Um, black cat or werewolf. Show your favorite Disney animal. And mine's not a black cat or a werewolf, but I love <laughs> me some Pua and Hey Hey. <laughs> I, pi I picked two. They are, oh, hang on. There we go. And I just love that pin. That's one of my very favorites. I think I like it's the so pretty. It. Yes, and it's big. I really like that pin. Yeah, that's a cute one. I don't, this is a hard one for me again, because if I was just to tell you my favorite Disney animals, I really think, um, Fox and the Hound. Oh, that's a good one. I love Fox and the Hound. They might be movie. my, I don't know. I don't know. And I love Jacques and Gus Gus. I, I don't know. But as far as pins that we had, because we're new to this, y'all, I love Marie. I think she She's is funny. just the sweetest little sassy sister there ever was. And that little bow... Y'all, come on. So cute. She's something special. The wink. Check check out. Come on, I'm going to put it back up there. Check out the wink. She's she's special. And that pin is just cute. It's just a cute pin. The backpack series, these were cute ones. They were really cute. Okay, number 11. We're almost there. Nightmare Before Christmas or Hocus Pocus. So we just watched Hocus Pocus over the weekend. Mm -hmm. And... I had never seen, seen it before. Seen it. What the heck is that about? Because we've seen it a bazillion times. I really in our have house. never. And I thought, like, while and I was watching it, we grew up together, it, so I don't know how. I don't know. I don't know. I thought, like, while I was watching it, I was gonna be like, oh, I'm gonna like start watching this, and then realize that I have seen this, and I hadn't. So I don't know what's wrong with you? I don't know how that. I happened. thought it was good, <laughs> but I really love Nightmare Before Christmas. Yeah, um, I think if I was just to sit down for movie night, I think I would pick Hocus Pocus. Mm -hmm. I, I I don't know. I like both. I think I give my husband a hard time because he always says his favorite Christmas movie is Nightmare <laughs> Before Christmas. And to me, it's more of a Halloween yeah. movie. Um, so I give him a hard time on that. But are you? You're there. He's over there. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> thought I heard you popping up over there. Okay. okay. Last one. Um, last one. Jack-o'-lantern. Show a Halloween pin. So we had to improvise a little bit on this one. Kind I of. have... Well, me. I have no like holiday pins at all so I chose <laughs> this one and I chose it because he's in costume cutie and I love I love and these pin. are new pins aren't they that one like weren't they newer I don't know no I could be totally making I don't your Meredith's uh Friends Aladdin set was a new set but maybe mm -hmm. that one's not I don't know I like that pin a lot I think I could have just been making that up completely anyways all right, so I just went with classic Jack Skellington. He's pretty cool. Totally classic pin. And this was one of our very first mm -hmm. when we purchased a trader set. And I kind of feel like this one might be a scrapper. Yeah. <laughs> but, it's okay because it's cute. You know, anyways. I'm okay. I know some of mine are, but I'm okay with it because yeah. I like it. And they look cute on a pin board just like the real ones do, y'all. You know, when we started pin trading, we knew nothing. And... And we needed now we cheap know. traders so that we could hopefully get some that weren't scrappers and cheap traders. But don't do that <laughs> because then you're trading real ones yeah. for scrappers. You're putting and scrappers into the park. That's not good. So don't we don't condone that, <laughs> but we didn't know when we first started. So some of ours are for sure scrappers, but as long as you like them. I feel like most of the rest of them that we showed. Yeah, I do think so too. We're real ones. I think so. So... You're supposed to tag somebody else, but it's two days to Halloween, and so yeah. we aren't going to tag anyone else just because I don't think they'll have enough time to do I'll a Halloween that pressure on someone. haunts tag. Yeah, yeah, that would make me a nervous wreck. Yeah. So we're, we're just, just going to say yeah. thanks, Siskateers, <laughs> for we tagging so us fun. and so letting us fun. do our very first pen tag. That was fun. All right. So okay. if you haven't already, hit the like and subscribe down there. Mm -hmm. And we will see you next time, Okies. Feel free to answer one of these questions down Ooh. below as well. Pick which question you want them to answer.
I don't remember. Pick one. Which question was the hardest? <laughs> What's your favorite villain song, and what villain power do you want to have? The villain power was a hard one. That was a hard one. Okay. 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 Let us Let know. Let us know. We're excited to hear your answers. Mm -hmm. All, All right. right. See you next time, Okies. Bye.